I'm Maria and today's in how to with UbiDots we are going to show you how to set up a Raspberry Pi with Node-RED to communicate data with UbiDots Cloud. So now let's get started. The requirements for today's video are an UbiDots account, Raspberry Pi 3 with the latest version of Node-RED pre-install and a one-wire temperature sensor. Now let's check the step by step. Our video today will include three steps. As always, you can find the timestamps and a written guide in the description below. To begin, connect the one wire temperature sensor to the Raspberry Pi using the pinout shown in this diagram. Now it's time to set up Node-RED. First, you need to access the Raspberry Pi. This can be done using SSH. Once you access the Raspberry Pi, you need to start running the Node-RED server by the command Node-RED start. Here we can see the logs and also how the Node-RED is running and the server is up. With the Node-RED active in the Pi, we can now open the Node-RED server using your preferred browser. Just open a new browser and in the URL bar, place the IP address and the port identifier assigned to the Pi. In today's example, we are reading temperature sensor. So to show this application in Node-RED, we need to install the node required. First, search the Windows node from the Manage Palette section. Then press install and wait until it finishes. Repeat the same process to install the sensor node, which is the DS18B20. Once the installation finished, you will be able to find the newly installed node in the palette here on the left side of the Node-RED interface. Now it's time to send data to Uyot's Cloud. Before we start, please make sure you have finished these previous requirements. To begin, we will import the Publish Clipboard from the Node-RED menu. Select the Node-RED menu, import, then Clipboard, and paste the clipboard provided in the description below. Locate the flow in the Node-RED workflow and to be able to establish the communication with your UbiDots account, assign your UbiDots token in the UbiDots node. To finish, press done and deploy your Node-RED workflow. Now, the behavior presented in the UbiDots node is connecting, then publish it. For testing purposes, a debug node is also included, activated in order to start receiving the debugging messages. With this final step, we can see Node-RED is receiving and pushing data to Ubiduts with the Raspberry Pi. Now, with the data already in Ubiduts Cloud, it is up to you to design the required visuals, alarms, and the branding of your Ubiduts Power IoT application. I hope you found this video tutorial useful. If you have any topic that you need help with, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get updates as they come. See you soon.